as well. And I think on that note, um, we could end because this is this is what I'm I'm I've been saying for the longest while. We know right and wrong, and we know what is good and we know what is bad. And nobody could convince me that some of these people did not know what they were doing and did not know the hurt that they were inflicting on people. And some of you, just because things was okay with you and it, it, it didn't cross your border and you, you didn't feel it, that it was somehow not real. And you didn't scream. And so now <laughs> the table is flipped. And these people are getting their just reward for the things that they did and the things that they say. You all of a sudden don't want to come and hold hands and sing Kumbaya. No. This must be a message to people who get into a position of authority. You must be just. You must be fear. Deal with people based on their merit. Not who they're affiliated with. Not their skin color. It's the same thing with people preaching all over the world. Discrimination. How could you discriminate against somebody? Simply just because. You ain't take a look at the, 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 the credentials. You ain't take a look at the file. But just because of the affiliation, just because of something you heard them say on a radio station, you're going to deny them of an opportunity. And then when your turn comes now, you want people to do what? Be sorry for you? Just do a professional and respectable and decent job. Just be a decent human being. It's not that hard. I don't understand for the life of me how some people could defend this kind of garbage. How? How? Look at their behavior. Look at the things that they said. Look at the things that they stood by and allowed to happen. I don't know. But some people need some serious reconciliation with themselves and with the Creator. And all these churches that people say they're going, they're close, they're close to church but far from God. And it's a sad reality. And at some point in time, people got to start to hold themselves accountable for their own behavior. And not because you work for somebody mean that you should carry out every single order that they give you. So you don't have no moral thing and a principle of your own. I work for Freedom FM, but <coughs> Junie can't just come here and tell me, oh, he can do this and he can do that. So I mean, I bring it on my own. And if it means that I have to vacate this job, Fine, so be it. Goodbye. But I have my own morals and principles to stand on and certain things I just ain't going to do. So why can't we be that way? Why? What's stopping us? What's preventing us from being that way? I work with people on a daily basis who know can't stand me guts, but I ain't got nothing to do with the job. Get the job done, goodbye. I don't have to sleep with them. I don't have to speak to them. They, they don't feed me. But we got a job to do. If everybody operate on that basis, the world would be ten times better. Believe me. Folks, that's going to do it for issues. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you so much for lending your voice.